What's up, everybody? My name is Puppeteer. And today, I have a show and tell collection. So, way back in the day, there was a lot of people at the time that had VHS tapes. And it's kind of sad because some people don't know what that is. <laughs> well, now, so. This one's a lot more different from the other ones. This one's more padded. It's very, yeah, padded, I guess is the word. And if you don't know what a VHS tape looks like, this is what it looks like. And usually it has like a book right here. Not all of them do, but some of them do. Once the movie was over, you gotta sit there and wait for it to rewind on a blue screen. So, we have Pinocchio. Next up, we have Walt Disney Masterpiece, Sleeping Beauty. This is, but this is Sleeping Beauty. This movie I don't really care for. But at the very end, it's a really cool um, piece where she starts dancing and her dress turns different colors from the fairy godmothers, I believe is what they are. Yeah. So that is another movie. Next up, we have... Uh, these are all Disney movies, by the way. Or, like, 95% of them are. We have Hercules. Fun little fact. Hercules was the first movie... I have ever seen in theaters and I think I was one and yeah so not, I don't know if you still count that but this movie is pretty good has a different meaning, I guess you could say, when you watch it as an adult, when you know the real reason of the whole, or like the behind the scenes of the movie. But yeah, it's a pretty good movie. It's kind of trippy, I guess is the term you could say or use for this. Next up, we have Pooh's Grand Adventure, The Search for Christopher Robin, the all-new movie. This is, uh, says you're braver than you believe. 
stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think. Yeah, VHS tapes are always very... Very clunky, I guess is the word. the movie this side a little black part the reel travels up to here goes down to here and it all goes this side and um, I don't want to make a loud noise but um, see there's the reel it's kind of messed up at that point on this side but said you have to sit there and watch it rewind all the way to this side that was the that was what it was back in the day but yeah Pooh's Grand Adventure next up we have one of my favorite Disney movies I guess old wise. We have three caballeros. This is actually a really good movie. It's like animated, but it's also live action, kind of. Like they have real people. They're doing stuff, and they have Don Duck or um, I forgot who else is in it. Or the other three guys, or the other two guys. I mean, they got Joe. Karaoke, and they got Panchito. Yeah, it's a masterpiece, is what the Washington Post said. And I believe it. Three Caballeros, definitely fun. They have that ride at um, Epcot in Disney World in Mexico. Next up, we have 101 Dalmatians. I remember I was really afraid of this movie. Because of Cruella de Vil. She was a scary villain. I did not like her. She frightened me as a child. But yeah, it's a really good movie. You should definitely check it out. <laughs> Make it sound like these are all like super new movies. Next up, we have a Bug's Life with Flick on the front. This movie, most of these movies like, I was frightened of. Um, I was afraid of Hopper, I believe was, was his name. That was the bad guy. And you have Flick. But yeah, these are super old movies now, I guess. Came out way back in the day. Next up, we have the movie Tarzan. This is a uh, really good movie. Most of these movies have really great soundtracks. This one, definitely. Um, Phil Collins is an amazing artist. And all these songs in this movie are really good. Same thing as Hercules and the Three Caballeros and all of them. Next up, we have Pocahontas. Surprisingly enough, I don't really remember this movie that well. should watch it. I still have a VHS tape slash DVD player. So, I don't know. I might watch it. Disney's done it again. That's what 
Joel Siegelson. Yeah. I'm gonna put this over here. Next up, we have the brave little toaster. Now, this movie frightened me because of one thing. There's a clown. And, uh, there's a clown in the movie, and, like, now, if you watch the movie, there's a part where the vacuum tries to kill himself in this movie. It's, like, super dark. Because he tries to eat his cord and pretty much kill himself. Which is crazy. But, um... Yeah, this was a good movie, though. Next up, we have 101 Dalmatians. I don't know if this is the same movie or not. I can't tell. I can't really tell. I think it might be the same movie, just different cover. I don't know why we have two of the same, though. Next movie, we have The Adventures of Ichabod and Mr. Toad. Now, I don't really remember this movie. I didn't even know I had this. But, I guess I had it. The 50th Anniversary Edition. Like I said, I don't remember anything about this movie or even remember having it. So I really can't tell you anything about it. Next up, we have Fun and Fancy Free, the original animated masterpiece, fully restored, limited edition, 50th anniversary. Um, I don't really remember anything about this. I know, I remember the, it's very, uh, what's the Jack and the Beanstalk-esque but besides I don't really remember anything else but yeah this is fun and fancy free you should definitely check it, check it out find it wherever you can probably Netflix or anything now I used to not like this movie as a kid not about the, the next one but I've kind of, now I've kind of appreciated it, and I really love the music in this movie, and that is Mulan, where I really love the, uh, I'll Make a Man Out of You song, but this song, or this movie is very, I guess you could say controversial, controversial, with the whole women thing, it's kind of, if you like, kind of look at it now or watch it now, you're kind of like, wow, Disney, that was kind of ballsy. Because if you listen to one of the songs, um, it's like worth fighting for, a girl worth fighting for. They're talking about all these, like, a, you know, a girl worth fighting for. And they want a girl that can cook and clean and this and that. And like a really hot girl. And then Mulan pretending to be a guy. She says, what about a girl with brains? And all the guys say, nah. <laughs> so, that was kind of ballsy on Disney's part. <laughs> but, next up, we have a very old classic, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. This movie also scared me with the witch there was a scene where she smiles and looks at the camera or looks at the screen and the screen goes black except her eyes and her smile I believe and I remember that, that scene just scared me and, um, the songs in this movie are really good too the oh, Next up, 
we have Robin Hood. This is a really good movie. The, uh, I remember parts of this movie, but I don't remember all of the movie. But, yeah, I just really liked this movie as a kid. It was really good. So you can see everything. We have one, two, three, four, five, six movies left. Next up, we got Winnie the Pooh, the mini adventure of Winnie the Pooh. The first one was Pooh's Great Adventure. And now we have the mini adventures. Um, Cheers for Winnie the Pooh, exactly right. Wistful, springly, or sprightly, sorry, and often hilarious. So yeah, it's Winnie the Pooh. Oh, and to be honest, I wasn't really a Winnie the Pooh fan. It just seemed too, like, kiddish to me, or kiddy. Which isn't bad, it's just for me at the time, I don't think I liked it. movie that just got remastered or remastered um, redone I guess remade um, The Jungle Book was remade into live action and apparently did really good I have, actually haven't seen a new live action movie but the this movie is really good um, Bear's Necessities I'll Make a Man Out of You Make a Man Out of You Wait I want to be like you. I want to walk like you. Talk like you. True. But, um, yeah, the movies in this, or the songs in this movie are really good. And it's full restored 30th anniversary limited edition. So I'm going to put this right here. And I don't know where the case is for this, but oh, this is a goodbye to Mr. Toad. Oh, I don't know. It was not in the case. Well, I'm gonna put put it over here. Alrighty. Next up, we have a very special movie that's pretty would go pretty well with the timing of right now, the holidays. But we have Adam's Family Values. Um, but yeah, that's pretty awesome. I haven't watched the Adam's Family movie in forever. This movie is actually over. See how the tape is on this side. Let's go back to this side. So yeah. Pretty good movie. I know there's, I think there's two movies, so I don't know which one the value is. I think it's probably the second one. Next up, we have one of my favorites. Not my favorite favorite, but up there, we have Aladdin. I can show you the world. Shine, shimmer, splendid. Sorry, I'm trying to sing, but at the same time, I'm trying to mostly whisper. seen this movie what the heck what are you doing fix that <laughs> we have another poo movie but this time it is the Tigger movie this movie is really sad because Tigger kind of feels lonely and wonder and everyone's kind of busy with their life and he starts realizing he doesn't really have a family but then um, everyone tries to make him feel better like Rue tried to dress up as Tigger, but, um, I don't want to spoil the movie, but, you know, good things come to Tigger at the end of the movie. But, uh, 
there. And last but not least, what is last? But we have the Lion King. Oh, I just a really good movie. It's really sad, if you know what I mean. If you've seen this movie, you know exactly why I mean. It's sad. Um, I don't want to spoil it if you haven't seen it, which if you haven't, what the heck are you doing? Why are you watching this video? Go watch The Lion King right now. <laughs> I know. I'm just kidding. But yeah, this is a really good movie. All these movies are really good movies. Well, Disney really good movies um or should I say Walt Disney Productions makes really good movies but yeah that is all my movies I hope you guys enjoyed that um if I miss any like I said if you have some movies I don't have remember make sure to tell me down below in the comments um if you have some of the same ones, tell me some of that. And, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this. Um, this is the second time I made this video. The first time I got accidentally deleted. But thank you guys so much for watching this.